Hey, welcome to Andy Dick's Gotcha Good, where we like to drive people nuts with our crazy little pranks and set em ups. We're on Hollywood and Vine today. Let's have some fun. Hey. And what the f is wrong with you, homie? Bling, bling. Why are you going? Gotcha Good. Gotcha Good. <laughs> gotcha Good. Jay Walker. Jay Walker, 12 o'clock. Woo, woo, woo. You're going to jail, buddy. I'm, I'm you're sorry, jaywalking. I don't know, I'm sorry. I don't you're know supposed you're to cross about. at a crosswalk. I'm just kind of out of it. I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah, you're out of it. You're right to jail. Right Citizens now. arrest I'm right sorry. here. This is gotcha good. You're going to jail, just buddy. You're going I, to jail. I just found out I have brain cancer. I can't deal with this right now. I'm sorry. Does that help? No. That doesn't help. Gotcha good. No. The brain cancer got me good. You didn't get me at all. Coming this fall, MTV brings you a show with a different point of view. Maybe too different. It's The Girl's View with Daphne Aguilera. Who do you think is hot? Heath Ledger. I like Justin Timberlake. Whatever. How many boy bands have you pleasured? Three for me. That's 18 boys. If you consider Limp Biscuit boys. <laughs> Tasty. <laughs> Ooh. It's fashion. I'm a little worried about bikini season. I know. My thighs look like a laundry bag full of snickerdoodle. <laughs> I know, me three. Plus my female foliage is way out of control. Somebody gas up the weed whacker, cause it looks like I got Don King in a leg lock. Uh, um. Do you know a good waxer? Cause mine died. It's fitness. Small motion. Small, very small. Ooh, I'm breaking a sweat. Butt drag. Butt drag. Feels good, huh? This is what I do when I get worms. Let's do it, girls. Butt drag. Ooh, that feels good. Come on! Lift those legs up, fatty. Pretend a new buffet opened in your neighborhood. I hate you! What? Whatever. The hottest celebrities. You are so dreamy. <laughs> well, thank you. <laughs> you guys are a lot of fun. <laughs> Where are the other girls? I'm right over here, Mr. Biggs. And by the way, I like mine a la mode. <laughs> You do like cherry pie, don't you, with an emphasis on the cherry? <laughs> Come on, take a little nibble. But be very careful, the filling is piping hot. <laughs> so, um... Jason. I remember my first kiss. Uh, tell us about it. Sixth grade, Scott. That is so cute. Jason, uh, I, I want you to myself. do me! Whoops, did I say that out loud? Good. <laughs> Are you into butt stuff? What? I'm sorry? Because I got a little butt work done myself. Because I had cottage cheese, and I think it's pretty smoothed out. Go ahead and touch uh, it if you want. I think that's my cue, too. Go ahead and touch it. Okay. <laughs> Girl! Jesus. Holy s***. <laughs> <God. laughs> ah! Okay, um... I trust you. Thanks, thanks for coming. The Girl's View with Daphne Aguilera, coming this fall to the 10 spot on MTV. I like numbers. Numbers can be your friend. Numbers are nice. People can be mean. <sighs> one plus one will always be two. That's a pretty little house there if you just add a roof. <sighs> but in real life, one plus one ends in a messy divorce and you will lose that house. Wow. Wow. Say, kids, who wants some caffeine? No. No, they don't want caffeine. Wake up! Coffee's got, got a big, big, big kick. When you want to stay awake, then it's the trick. Early in the morning when you're feeling kind of low, grab a cup of joe and go, go, go. Wake up! Wake up! Go have a cup or maybe two. Wake up! Wake up! It's made for me, so it's good for you. It's one of the five basic food groups. Fruits, vegetables, hams, cheeses, fast foods, and 
coffee. So get your day started off right. I'm shaking. That means that the beans are on the scene. Now how's about a fresh one? Wake, Wake up! Brought to you by the American Caffeine Council, reminding you the caffeine's not illegal yet. <laughs> Next on the Andy Dick Show. If cheers were money, I would have silver dollars dropping one by one out of my hole. Hey, that's a good. Hey, gotcha good. Well, you're a pretty little thing. What's in here? Let me go through your purse Mama, here. Cream? Don't. Oh, I don't need any cream. Sure don't need cream. Ooh, that's funny. Ooh, gotcha good. Oh, here we go. What are these? Uh, Mints? No, those are my epilepsy pills. I've suffered from seizures ever since I was brutally Gotcha good. Gotcha good. Ah! No, no, you I'm... son of a bitch. No, no, just... You bastard. Gotcha you want sex? No, Is that what you want? Get down. Contrary to popular belief, I am not a cheerleader, but I like to think that the cheers that I write lead people to a place where they win. If cheers were money, I would have silver dollars dropping one by one out of my hole. Like anything that requires discipline, writing cheers requires discipline. Like Hemingway, when he wrote The Great Gatsby. You don't think that was one long extended cheer? Well, it was. Those were the best of times. Those were the worst of times. Go team. And you just drop the go team part and you just keep writing and writing and writing and writing and writing and writing and writing. And, writing. and then you got a novel. I could write novels. I choose not to write novels because I like writing cheers because then I get to work with young, hot, supple women. We're gonna take it from the top and you're gonna inject it with energy. One, two, three. Up. Ooh, the wind caught your skirt there. The first cheer I ever wrote went something like this. <clears throat> Go team! It's simple, it's to the point, it's a classic. Then, uh, of course, I found uh, rhyme. Two, four, six, eight, who do we appreciate? That one pretty much wrote itself. We're like wolves, and you're like little rabbits. We're stalking you, and you're hopping away. Oh, damn it! Of course, not all of my cheers are instant hits. They can't all be gems. We're gonna win, you're gonna lose, unless you win, and then of course we're the losers! <laughs> victory, victory, that's our cry. You are P-O-O-P-Y. France, Spain, Sweden, China, their team stinks like my Every morning after I get done watching the videotapes of the young, supple women jumping around in their short skirts, I will spend a good three or four hours at my typewriter writing cheers. Here, let me help you down. Ooh, there we go. Oh, I'm falling. Oh, whoops, I'm sorry. I could write a cheer about this coffee mug right now. Watch this. Well, give me a minute. I'm not used to working under this kind of pressure, okay, with a crew of idiots breathing down my neck. Here we go. Coffee, coffee, put it in. Then our team will win, win, win. F you. The wind can be your enemy, okay? Not only can it lift your skirt up, but sometimes it can just pull it right down. And we gotta be careful of that. If I wrote the cheer, then it works. Maybe you're not working it. That's why I put you in these tight little numbers with the frilly, Soft little and the and the with what was your question? The cheer's just not working. Well, what's the cheer? Go, go, go. That took me three hours to write. Give me one minute here. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> go, 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 red. Um, Hang on a minute before you just crap on my head. What color are your uniforms? They're red. They're red. There we go. 
Kismet. Go, 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 red! Go, go, red! Oh, I just felt a, something shoot up my butthole, <laughs> and I think it's called victory. Let me write it down for you real quick. Go, 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 red, okay. Go, 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 red, that's it. Okay, that's good, oh, I like it. You take that Xerox it and give one to me so I can put it in my file cabinet. Thanks, Mr. Valance. Bye, Megan, bye, Cindy, bye, Cindy, bye, Cindy, bye, Katrina, bye, Megan. I'll be out there in a minute to feel you up. Out, I'll help you out. Damn it. Go, 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 go. red, and push it out there. Go, 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 red, red. push that. Stop groping me. Damn. Oh, that is it. What's up? I quit. Don't worry, I am not gonna let you down. Okay, I'm gonna step in and step up. Go, 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 red. Go, 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 red. <laughs> Whoa, whoops, the wind went up on me there. Good game. All right, I'll, I'll see you in the locker room. I'll get you. Just when you thought armed combat couldn't get any more fun, it's war bloopers, bleeps, and practical jokes. Chock full of military mishaps and combat cut em ups, like foxhole foul ups. There's a timeless joke, still funny, unless he dies, ha ha ha. Bombs away, you'll also get Nazi nitwits and ninnies. Watch a goose step there, Mr. Heil Hitler, and don't forget loopy limb losers. Whoa, that's kooky. Two unarmed soldiers. Whoopsie daisy. Now that's real hand to hand combat. <laughs> Oh, now, there's one lucky GI. I didn't know the Nazis played dominoes. Out, Blitzkrieg. Say there, GIs, is that old glory or old glory? Ho! March to victory with these war blooper favorites. Ho ho! Operators are standing by with their field telephone. Order now for immediate delivery to your home front. Call 1-555-WAR-IS-HELL. Hella funny. Act now and you will also receive the Backyard Biological Warfare Fun Kit. Not to be used on a windy day. Next on The Andy Dick Show. I don't think a lot of people know that my mom has played such an important part in my career. Andy's mom? Yes. We're going to need Andy in two minutes. He'll be ready when I say he's ready. Was it funny today? Oh, yeah, yeah. Really funny. Not in front of my friends, Mom. I am your only friend. Uh, uh, Hello. Well, he's not Hello shy. in there. Knock, knock. Maybe I should uh, give him a little glass of anti-shy juice. Please, what? what we, he, he'd rather not. What's that? Can't catch your tongue? Mm. As a matter of fact, that is what happened. Cat chewed off his tongue. He can't talk. Gotcha, good. Watch this. I'm going to really get somebody. I'm going to jump out at him and just scare the bejesus out of him. This is going to be fun. Gotcha, go! <laughs> oh! Oh my god. Let's get out of here. Come on! I don't think a lot of people know that my mom has played such an important part in my career. She's always there. She's there to make sure I do it right. Just like a little Hitler mother but in a good way. We have our own show now, so we're really in overdrive. Well, cut to me taking a third waitressing job in order to convert the garage into a rehearsal space, because frankly, he really does need a lot of practice. Let's go, Andy! No! Where is the audience? Right there. Oh, fuck. Where is the audience? I don't know. The audience is always in front of you. <laughs> Like that. No. Oh. Watch. No. Do you remember all your questions for Ashton Kutcher tomorrow? Well, I have them on those cards. Mm -hmm. yeah. Good night, then. Good night.
Mommy, check under the bed. I swear to God, I heard a frickin' Dracula. I mean, sure, it looks easy, but ooh, it's it's not. It's just like you say. If you want to make it good, you got to make it hard. That's not what I said. Oh, no, no, no. If you want to make it uh, good, look good, or if you want to make it good, Uh, no, no well, you didn't even get close. Well, just make it look good is your motto. Andy's mom? Yes. We're going to need Andy in two minutes. He'll be ready when I say he's ready. Okay. Give me your retainer. This is going to be fun, huh, Mom? Just okay. don't embarrass me. I won't. How do I look? You look like an ass. Well, because you always said... You... Shut the f*** up and get out there. Okay, yeah. Actually, that does sound familiar. <laughs> well, let's say hi to Ashton Kutcher. We're here, we'll just move this over here and then we'll be all right, huh? <laughs> Anyways, what's going on? <laughs> Not a whole lot. How are you? Did you have fun doing Dude, Where's My Car? I, yeah, I had fun. Did you have fun doing it? I would have had more fun if I had the part that you stole from me, you know. Do you have any other movies that you want to steal right out from under me? I just tried to do my job, man. Well, maybe for me, you can do it a little crappier and then maybe I can get a movie or two. You have your own show, I man. I don't give a about this show I would like to have my you know my own show if I, if I had well you can have this show I don't want th this show how's that 70s show it's great it's really really good do you have musical guests or anything do you sing no what uh, is this like usual the usual format for your for your show do you do, do your interviews or I think you're trying to do this. <laughs> and that's kind of, that's what. <clears throat> Was it funny t today? Oh yeah, yeah. It's really funny. Not in front of my friends, Mom. I am your only friend. I am the one that birthed you for seventy-seven hours. That's why your head is shaped the way it is. Just go get in the town car. All right. I'll, yeah. Walk like a man. Yes, mother. Where is the car? Wait, mom. Where is the frickin' Excuse me, sir, but uh, I'm going to have to ask you to leave, please. Why? Is, is the store closing already? No, 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 it's not that. I, I just need you to leave now, please. Well, I'm, I'm shopping, please. Well, no, I, I'm afraid I must insist. Why? It's just that uh, we don't serve your kind here. My kind? You're a little small, aren't you? Yeah, but I, I, I just... Yeah. Oh, careful. Just need a new jacket for the cotillion. May I help you, sir? Yes, I'd like to see a few suits, please. Oh, certainly. What type of suit are you looking for? A business wear, formal attire? Something I could wear to a cotillion. Idiot! Um, I mean party, not a cotillion. No cotillion. Ah, well, here. Uh, something like this. That looks great. Well, follow me to the dressing room. Sir. 
Well, you're not going through the cotillion. What's a cotillion? Shut up. Aha! Uh -huh. Run! Tim Tim! I caught you, little Tim bastard! Tim Tim! I told you, we don't serve you little freaks here. Now get out and stay out. Why do they hate us so much, Andy? Ignorance, Chim Chim, ignorance. I'm scared, Andy. Yeah, I know, you should be. But don't worry about it. Someday the world will be safe for people like us, Chim Chim. Someday. Next week on The Andy Dick Show. The ratings are down. And? And what are you going to do about it? Sir, watch The Andy Dick Show. Off. What are you doing? My ratings have dipped, and it's all because of you. Watch the Andy Dick Show! Open. Why are you so stupid? Hey! Hey! Check it. Yeah, but that is. Well, you guys. Oh, there you go. I don't think he'll get to the top of the cross. Not bad, not bad. I like this stuff. How much is this? I'll take two. I Open. Why are you so stupid? Stupid. Uh -huh.